is going to be a, um, but we are not in a row. This is going to be a, a video of what you need to have and, uh, for your hermit crab. Okay, guys. <coughs> I know this isn't a regular hermit crab, <coughs> hermit crab cage, but, um, it was like my old food tank and I just put them in there. It's a bigger room now. Okay. For mine, I have pink sand inside and I do have some tiny little seashells spread around. Okay. I have this. It's like a little swim pool for them. It's made for them. Um, you can buy them at our local, well, pet shop, Mr. Local Pet Shop. I have some little seashells in here, um, water in here, and a rock in case the little one I have drowns. So, yeah. Can't really show y'all. Can't get sand. Computer. But that's what's inside of them. Ah, where is it? See it? Uh, it's got some pink sand in it too because, um, the crabs like to get in and out. So, yeah, mainly a big one gets stuck in there. Okay. So this is um one of the shells. Uh, let me lean up everywhere. This is one of the shells um for my big one. You can get them at Myrtle Beach. Um yeah. Or and uh there's another one this is another one for my big crab, my hermit crab, my big one right here and I have an explanation why I'm holding it like this because I don't get sand on my computer yeah I don't like getting it like you know, sticky and all oh. uh, so this is one it's not as big as it looks just the inside small it's from a small one my little one the inside small it just looks big because the type of shell it is so yeah and this is the other one other shell I have for the hermit crab. I mean, for the little small hermit crab. I think it's like one colorful. And the inside is pretty small, but bigger than what you get. Yeah. Um, I'll show you all my big crab. He was seven ninety nine. I mean, yeah, seven six ninety nine at the pet store. Stay in there. Sorry, it's a little freaky. Okay, he was. Does he fall back in here? It freaks me out. Okay, I'm put a Q tip here. So Okay, I'm putting a Q-tip here so I don't fall out. I'm just scared. I don't want him to touch me or nothing. I don't like that. But that's what it says. Okay. Uh, oh. Hmm. Okay. Alright, yeah. Okay. Um. He is. Ugh, let me stay in there. Okay. He was seven six ninety nine at the pet shop. Um. He comes in that shell. He, um, is. He was seven ninety nine. I think he's a pink, purple pincher. He has a purple pincher. And here he is. His name is Perry. I know that name is weird, but. Okay. Um, this one is a, I forgot what kind of crab type it's called. But it was only 99 cents. And if you are wondering, it comes in the show. And if you are wondering why it has a pink dot right here. Right there, if you wonder why it has a dot right there with sparkles, it's because I took my nail polish and done it while he was in there, and it didn't hurt him. Okay, and here he is. He don't. Oh, that's just a bag. Okay, so, um, if you're wondering why it don't come out, I think it's because he's scared because he's alive. I just leave him here until he does. Okay, as long as my face is in it, will come out. So, yeah. Okay. For his food, um, they gave us some, well, you have to buy it separate. I'll show you all the packs in a minute. I put it in a seashell, a seashell. And this is what his food looks like. And this is... <coughs> This is what his food looks like. I where's that? I think that's it. Where? This is what his food looks like, and it is in a shell, as you can now see. Um, so yeah, I'll switch you back. I'll be right back. Hold on guys, I'll 
don't forget me, I just gotta figure out where I put it. here. It comes all the way up to the top, right? Food for hermit crabs. You all can get them at the pet shop, whales, waves, and all. Um, for this little pack, it'll last you about two weeks. Two ninety nine. Two ninety nine. It's kind of overpriced, but I got three of these, and they have been lasting with them for weeks, weeks, weeks. Some people say, they say to, um, like, get them fresh food every two days, but that would cost a lot. So, I just give them when it, when it when it looks mucky and needs to be freshened. That's when I give them new ones. But if you're like very 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 scared, like all your hermit crabs have died, and you're like very very scared that it'll die, so you might want to put fresh stuff in there. But mine's in a healthy environment. The big one comes out all the time. The small one just likes to hide. I guess it might just need to name it. Shy. <laughs> but Perry comes out a lot, so yeah. Think. These are some of the hermit crab shells that I do have, but don't fit in there. Okay, so you can buy this cage right here for them for two twelve ninety nine. Yeah. It comes with a palm tree and a little place to put food and sponges. Oh, these shells in here? Oh, I've, I've had them for like years or years. Okay. First, about shells. I have this shell. It's kind of like the one on the movie Aquamarine where her dad's calling her in. So, yeah. If you ever saw that movie, it's the same. Um, that's it. Mm. This is a shell I have. Um, it's, yeah, but it's like where to put your food, their food in. Here's another shell I have. I know it looks similar to the one that's in that. Uh, and here's another shell I have just recently from a crab that I have had. Pink Floyd Hell Shell. Okay, and I want to show y'all this one. In the inside, it is very waxy and very shiny. Let's put their hack in that shell. Poor guy, I miss him. So, yeah. And, and, um, also, you can't just put one shell in there with the hermit crab. You can put a variety of them in there, or at least two. Because if they don't want that one shell, they're going to stay in there and they could die. Just letting you know. So, I would put two in there just to be safe. Okay. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Um, please subscribe up top and um, please comment below. And please press the like button. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thanks for watching.